So let me try and pass the baton back to you on our next game, which is Dodgers-Cardinals. Huge comeback for the Dodgers late against St. Louis. And they're favored once again here today. Anderson, Hudson, total is a nine. What are you doing with St. Louis in L.A.? Yeah, if we take a look, you know, sometimes we like to equate those full season statistics with 30 day numbers here to try to make them make some sense. So if I'm looking from a Dodgers perspective, it might be the team total for the Dodgers that catches my attention. You see the total in the game at nine and the Dodgers priced at a minus 154, which you can agree with that because the Dodgers one through nine are very good each and every night. And as long as they have an average pitcher on the mound, they're typically favored. But let's take a look at the last 30 days for Hudson, the right handed pitcher here for the Cardinals. He's done well against lefties right around average 322 when on base percentage iso power number very low though here at an 061 but if we take a look from the right hand side over the last 30 days his weighted on base percentage versus right-handed batters is a 383 now let's take a look at the dodgers lineup today and again condense the season from them from a full season down to 30 days with what this lineup has been doing against right-handed pitching over the last 30 days it's been absolutely sensational nine batters in the lineup tonight kevin the lowest guy on the totem pole here versus right-handed pitching over the last 30 days is Max Muncy, 81 at bats. He's got a 134 ISO power number. Everybody else at least a 183 or higher. And if we take a look at weighted on base percentages here, last 30 days for this Dodgers lineup against right-handed pitching, seven of those nine batters above a 326. So if I'm looking to just isolate this game for myself, let's keep those Dodgers bats in the lineup tonight and see if they can take down a team total. 